Hello everyone, my name is Nato and today we are again making another video about uh, Open Pilot Co It is and everything. By the way, I'm using Honda Accord 2018, as you guys know, like Aragon 777 works best for Honda. So let's do that. Uh, so as you guys can see in the monitor, it says calib calibrating in progress, 17% uh, drive above 15 mile. Let's do it, guys. Let's do it, baby. Woo! By the way, guys, I already uh, used uh, this version, so I pretty much uh, know like how it behaves. But uh, just for you guys, I just installed it and uh, want to share some experience, you know. So it says 70%, uh, 71% uh, and 84. So it's just calibrating right now, you know. And it's just dead it baby let's do it okay let's do it so by the way i can i can turn on like no nugging lane change and everything so there are like lot lot more options in the setting right now because it's a custom fork so you have flexibility and everything and let's do it guys okay so let's turn that on it turned on i just increased the speed to 35 as you guys can see the steering wheel is rotating itself yes so um, so as you guys can uh, as you guys know already like I'll, I also made a video about the uh, the basic fork the open pilot AI fork which uh, has some bombers I already made a video about it link in the description but this fork works so much better like last video I gave open pilot AI fork the main fork like 25 or 30 out of 100 but this fork I'm gonna give 35 why I'm giving 35 because Toyota works much better right so if I give it like 40 then the like like you know like it works as good as Toyota but it is not because as you guys can see like it can rotate this steering wheel almost uh, very like almost very good uh, like compared to the like main fork right so I'm gonna say um, like it's gonna get like 35 or 40 but the Toyota will get like 50 right out of 100 and the Tesla will get like 80 right you know what I mean so um, and it's pretty good at night time I'm driving the car is driving itself I'm not increasing any speed the car knows uh, if there is anything in front of uh, me because it has the sensor Honda sensing sensor um, it's a bummer for Honda car because their torque of a steering wheel is pretty bad so it doesn't turn all the way like the toyota did a fantastic job on their uh, steering wheel torque and it doesn't even uh, stop on red light so i have to stop myself so i have to brake uh, and it will uh, stop but in the main fork if you press uh, gas the uh, open pilot also stop too but in this fork it doesn't stop as you guys can see this car is a little bit sharp it says take control but the car um, actually did it right so which is pretty good I was in 36 mile an hour and the car did it so uh, it told me to take control but uh, it did it which is uh, like pretty good and also right now we're going 42 mile per hour and the car is doing uh, you know fantastic I'm gonna say uh, this lane is uh, not that much visible but as you guys can see the car is rotating itself I'm not doing anything I'm just uh, aware of the uh, situation the car uh, goes to the wrong lane as you guys can see um, so you know I told you already like this is the problem with open pilot or it's not the problem with open pilot to be honest with you is the problem with my car this car is 2018 model it doesn't have like that much torque in his um, steering wheel as you guys can see in this monitor uh, it uh, shows the lane perfectly so I'm gonna say this is not a fault of open pilot this software is amazing but uh, this is my car's fault I, I really hope like the new car models um, like you know make the steering wheel torque pretty good like Tesla so that we can use the full power of open pilot I really hope at least one car company makes a steering wheel like Tesla 
whatever torque the Tesla has in their um, car um, I really hope like one day they will match with this kind of torque so let's again turn on and uh, let's try also you can maintain the distance of the car with this uh, button in the car of Honda like at one for one car distance four three two you can just choose yourself you know what I mean so yeah as you guys can see in front of us there are one car and the car will it's like um, like you know break itself because it's already uh, seized the car in front of us so it's pretty good but I'm I'm frustrated um, on Honda because um, uh, because of Honda it doesn't support this camera we have two cameras on Coma 3 right but uh, it doesn't work with that camera it only works with Honda sensing which is very frustrating if the car uh, if the software works with those camera and uh, it can see if it sees like anything on the camera and everything as you guys can see um, Yeah, it doesn't it doesn't uh, stay in the same lane. It uh, moves to the other lane um, So yes, let's see Yeah, guys, what do you guys think like uh, make sure you subscribe to our channel because I'm gonna make more videos about uh, Honda Toyota open palette and also Tesla I have also a Tesla model 3 I already ordered another one model Y so we are gonna make all those videos uh, recently so let's see what this car does and I really like this sound like on the uh, main software uh, the sound is pretty loud and also every time I press gas right now I press gas right it didn't um, like uh, yeah it did probably yeah it, it, it turned off the open pilot but I have to go to the settings so I can just uh, press like don't turn off whenever I press gas uh, it has that option on the settings so yeah guys uh, hopefully you guys are doing great uh, I'm gonna go to that gas station to make a turn and uh, let's see uh, we are gonna stay he here. I know I'm garbage on driving, but it is what it is. And let's see what it does with no lane mark. Okay, guys, there is like no, no lane marking over here, and uh, it doesn't even stop on the stop sign like Tesla does. So I hope uh, in future software update and uh, they can do it, you know. So I just uh, gave that. Um, uh, 35 speed an hour and it doesn't have uh, anything okay it's pretty close oh my goodness guys I was almost hitting that car I'm lucky okay there is no lane it always stays right and it doesn't even know there is a car or a stop right over here you know this is what it is yeah like this is frustrating I'm gonna say if the car uses the camera that would be great unfortunately it only uh, uses the sensor in front of our car the Honda sensing software uh, the sensor sorry my bad and uh, yeah that's why uh, Honda sensing doesn't work with a stop car so if there is a car already stopped in front of you it didn't even stop so it will hit the car in front of you so you have to be very careful about that like if there is anything you have to just take control you know what I mean I saw something okay so yeah that's it for today guys uh, let me know in the comment what do you want to see and uh, what's your reaction did you ever tried this fork before and uh, yeah thank you for watching make sure you subscribe to our channel i love you guys you have a wonderful night take care of yourself bye bye